the way that that we do what we do it's according to how we sense in the present but also how we have sensed a long time So an example, I am Mexican and we eat a lot of tortillas and bolillos. So this is a bolillo and oh, it smells so good, it smells, it smells like home. So the doing around the eating has a feeling to it that, that pertains to a belonging and a, fo a full identity but not but at every level <laughs> so so we we use the forks and the spoons but we also use pieces of bolillos like like is a, yeah, as if it was another piece of of cutlery and as i've been doing this since four decades i am very good at eating with bolillos and tortillas I learned how to do it. In the same way that I learned how to eat sushi with chopstick, chopsticks. But as you see, I am skillful, but, but not as, skill, as skillful as someone that has been eating with chopsticks at every meal since four decades ago. So, here comes education. So it's in our genes. It's, it's inherited knowing how to eat in the same way that it is knowing how to have sex. But our education and practice molded the details around eating, meaning I learned how to use bolillos and tortillas, and I also learned how to use chopsticks, but one is a more practiced skill than the other. And same goes with sex and sexuality. You know how to, you, your body knows how to um, get your juices flowing. Thank you.